Hey, what up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Ari Temkin, and on today's video, we're talking about Zeke Elliott testing positive for COVID and what it means for the Cowboys and for the National Football League. Today's video brought to you by betonline.ag. BetOnline, your online sportsbook experts. Also, if you enjoy this video, consider liking and subscribing to the page so you can get the latest information and news on your Dallas Cowboys. Monday morning, we learned that multiple Cowboys and Texans players had tested positive for COVID-19, and then Ian Rappaport of NFL Network reporting that one of those positive tests was from Ezekiel Elliott of the Dallas Cowboys. Here's the most important thing that you should take away from this video. Don't be surprised by positive tests in the NFL. We've already seen this at the collegiate level when universities have welcomed back student athletes and then they're back on campus, they get tested and they're coming back with positives. So all of the protocols and procedures that have been put in place, especially at these universities, are in line with what happens after we get positive tests. The same will be true for the NFL. It's not if there's positive tests, it's when there's positive tests. Now we also shouldn't be surprised by Zeke Elliott's positive test because Zeke Elliott is careless. Do we need more evidence of that to support that fact? Or is Zeke Elliott's career pretty indicative of the fact that Zeke Elliott does not care? He's careless. He doesn't care what you think. He doesn't care about optics. He is careless when it comes to his behavior, and he clearly is careless when it comes to social distancing. We saw the same thing from Dak Prescott. Dak Prescott threw a party. He got mad that people got mad that he threw a party, then diminished the amount of people that were there and said it's no big deal. Well, it's no big deal, but here's what happens during a pandemic when you throw parties and you're out training with Zeke Elliott and Des Bryant and Dave Robinson at his training facility. You put yourself in a position to potentially come down with this virus. Dak Prescott has shown a level of carelessness throughout this, and so has Zeke Elliott. Ergo, Zeke Elliott tests positive for coronavirus. You know, I get asked all the time about, what's this football season look like, and what can we expect? And my answer is always the same. It's like, at this point right now, you can't tell Jerry Jones that he's gonna have 16 football games, eight of those inside a stadium, and there's gonna be a full house, 100,000 people plus, at every one of his football games. You can't tell Jerry that that's not going to happen. And the NFL, much like college football, is putting policies and procedures and protocols in place to ensure that when they have positive tests, they have the right policies, protocols, and procedures in place to make sure that it doesn't become large scale in their locker room. But none of that matters so long as players operate with this carelessness, with this ease, where they continue to socialize, they continue to go places, they continue to put themselves in position to where they can contract this virus, bring it to the locker room, and then give it to other players. Are we gonna have football this year? And the truth of the matter is, you can do everything safe and by the book and still come down with the virus because there's so many unknowns about it. So when the question that comes to me is, do you think we're gonna have football this year? My answer is, I have trust and faith that these organizations have the right protocols and procedures in place in order to ensure that they can put themselves in best position to have football this season. But if players don't take it more seriously, and commit to full-scale social distancing throughout this football season, then there's a very good chance we're not going to have any football in 2020. You know, there's no shortage of action going on at my partner, betonline.ag. Sports are slowly making their way back with UFC, NASCAR, and soccer all leading the way. BetOnline has all the best odds and lines for all the upcoming games and matches this weekend. Need more? BetOnline has simulated NBA, NFL, UFC, all happening every day live for you to check out. Looking for something else other than sports? BetOnline has hundreds of live casino games, poker tournaments, and all the best props in the business. Visit betonline.ag or use your mobile device and join today to receive your free welcome bonus. And start playing today. BetOnline, your online sportsbook experts. 